Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. Collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Fans, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. Who? Their leader. Joseph C. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Be 
the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spook easily. Rook, I'm me. Stay loose, huh? What are they doing here? Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Sheriff, I don't like this. Everything's fine, I see. Everything's just fine. Jesus Christ. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges when they here. They'll respect the dying millimeter. Not every problem can be solved in a bullet, Marshal. Quit, sir! started the project because we know what happens next they will come they will try to take from us take our guns take our freedom take our faith we will not let them sheriff come on we along we will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore sheriff there know, will be no more faith. suffering oh, Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. Keep back! 
Rookie, keep up. I am a federal marshal. I'm ordering you to stand back. Just fine here. I don't need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you. No one is coming to save you. God has kept you under the shadow of his wings. Everything is unfolding according to God's plan. I am still here with you. The first seal has been broken. The collapse has begun. And we will take what we need. We will preserve what we have. And we will kill all those who stand in our way. And these, the harbingers of doom, will see the truth. Begin the I lost him. I see uh, a trailer. 
alert nearby. It's next to a long bridge. I'm gonna try and get inside. If anyone's still out there, listen. If anyone's still alive. Jesus Christ. Rook, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula, and then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard, and we're gonna take out the rest of these... Okay, shh. Truck. 
Use it! You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. <laughs> 
get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation. What's your status? Hello? Come here, deputy. We need to talk. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. The little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want him back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken, too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Be careful out there. It's crawling with Peggy's. Those fuckers are willing to die for that psychopath. Resolve them soon. Ah. You 
can't resist the You don't have to be a hero, but... Thanks for saving my sorry ass. These loony fanatics are... Control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. That was too close. Thanks. Usually a bunch of useful shit that's been squirreled away. We'll go take a look. 